So we're all totally connected now with our uh, tablets, our laptops, and I, I don't think a lot of people realize some of the exciting features that smartphones have, especially the iPhone, being able to actually use its internet connection to power your laptop. Absolutely. Um, so what's interesting is we talk a lot about smartphones and tablets together, um, sharing your data as a Wi-Fi hotspot from your phone like you talked about, Mike. But you can do that for any other Wi-Fi connected device as well. So your MacBook here is a great example. So if I go into settings, what you can see is there's a personal hotspot setting in the latest iPhone iOS 4.3 upgrade. So what I'll do is I'll just turn it on, which it's here. This is now a discoverable Wi-Fi hotspot that I have. So if I go into your airport utility, up in here, here we go, we should have, there it is. So you basically select it. Select it and I've got it set up with security, I have a password set up in here, and I'll just add it. And that way no one else can get into it unless they have the password. Yeah, exactly. So I'll just set this up, click OK, and now we're connected, that easy. And so basically, we're just using the data plan off the iPhone itself. We don't have to get another data plan. Absolutely. So what this is, and it actually says I've got the one connection that's on here, but I basically have the one data bucket that I have on my plan for the iPhone 4 that's sharing this with us now. You're exactly right. It's easy data sharing. So I don't have to have another stick or SIM card or another account or something like that for my mobile account. I just have the one easy to manage, easy to use, as you see. Everyone's got one of these in their pockets already. You can power the things that you have around you. Fantastic. Well, thanks uh, for going through the steps, James. Thank you, Mike. Great way to uh, really take advantage of the full functionality of your uh, iPhone 4.